So I'm going to use GX Web to prove the theorem that the distance from a point on the submedian of a triangle to the two including sides, the, those two distances are proportional to the lengths of those sides. Now, um, the submedian um, is the image of the median under reflection in the angle bisector. So here we'll, we'll start working on that. This theorem, start with a triangle. A triangle like that will look good enough. And let's give uh, the sides lengths. Um, is those ratio of those lengths is what we're going to be uh, actually looking for. And now we need to create the submedian. Well, first of all, we'll create the median. The um, best way to do that is select B and AC and use the midpoint construction. This both constructs the midpoint of AC and joins it up to B to give us the median. Um, now, the submedian is the reflection of that in the angle bisector. So let's first let's create the angle bisector. We pick, select the two lines and the bisector uh, construction. And now we need to find the image of this, this median uh, and reflect, but reflected in that angle bisector. So for that, we use the reflection construction. Uh, here's this, reflect it in there. So uh, BF is the submedian. And if we want to put a point at some arbitrary location on that, um, let's just make that at location T, the parametric location T. So that's really going from 0 to 1 from B to F there. Now what we'd like to do is look at the distance from G to AB. So like that, and let's look at the distance from G to BC. Well, we can see that these look the same, except there's a C in that one, and there's an A in that one. So if we if we if we uh, divide one by the other, distance of G to AB. Uh, divided by G to BC. Um, we find that that is um, C over A, which is the ratio of the side lengths. And that is the theorem um, that we were trying to prove. <laughs>